Today it's all about the SuperFormance shock absorbers for all Vespa models with a separate spring and damper suspension. Almost all shock absorbers currently available for the Vespa models with a separate spring and damper suspension have no effective damping function, mostly due to their technical layout. One of the main aims in designing the SuperFormance shock absorber was to provide optimal damping during the rebound phase. The rebound damping ensures a clean and even shock absorber expansion at a controllable rate. This causes, for example during braking, the front end of the scooter to recover softly and remain controllable without acting like a pogo stick. The damping process takes place in two separate chambers, one filled with gas, the other with oil. Shock bushes are made out of polyurethane rubber. These shock absorbers are available with two separate grades of stiffness, 60 psi and 100 psi. An important factor is the choice of spring. We recommend springs with at least a 33% increase in stiffness or STO springs. First, remove the wheel. Then, deflate the tire and place it to the side. Undo and remove the lower fixing bolt. Undo and remove the upper fixing bolt. Remove the shock absorber. Put the replacement shock absorber into the upper fixing and use the nut and bolt to fix it in place. Now, with the help of an assistant, compress the spring until the lower fixing bolt can be inserted. Tighten firmly to hold the new shock absorber in its final position. Replace the rear wheel. And do not forget to reinflate the tire. Job done! Your shock absorber is mounted. To check if the spring is stiff enough, compress it a few times. If it's pushed down too far by the shock absorber and an unnatural looking angle is apparent, you will require a stiffer spring. Thanks for watching, subscribe to our channel.